Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again. So today we are going to talk about Bridgeton, New Jersey, and something that uh, happened on Christmas Day that never happened, but caused quite a stir, and it reminds us of some of the limitations when it comes to certain new technology, particularly when it comes to news. Okay, so what happened? A, uh, a site called Newsbreak had an article on it that has now been deleted. Um, but the article detailed the circumstances of a murder that occurred in Bridgeton, New Jersey on Christmas Day. This is from the PD there, police department in Bridgeton. Nothing even similar to this story occurred on or around Christmas, or even in recent memory for the area they described. It goes on, The article does not have an author and states at the bottom, This post includes content assisted by AI tools. This content was assisted by AI and may contain errors. Please verify critical information with trusted sources. So, since it was removed, there, there's not a lot of investigating I can do to track down like how all of this came to be. But it certainly appears as though somebody who was using AI to write articles generated not just a story about an event, but generated an entire event. It never occurred. Um, so, this is one of those questions that comes up. How is AI going to impact the news? It's not. Not really. When you compare this to instances where they tried to use AI to like cover high school sports and how bad it has gone, it, it, it shows that AI is not to the level it needs to be at to function when it comes to news. It's important to remember that AI is not AI in the way that you might imagine it from science fiction. It scrapes information. So when it comes to news, it has to be put out there by a person first. Otherwise, it's not going to be in the data set. And if you were to try to get it to write an article, saying you, maybe you want something unique about a crime or something like that. It may just literally make one up. Please remember this as more and more news agencies experiment with AI. Just assume that the information is wrong. View it as a... View it as a good way to get a summary but that you're probably playing a game of telephone and that as it progresses and it aggregates different outlets and it scrapes that information and puts it together, that it is going to get major pieces of the story and present them in, well, a less than accurate way. Or it may just make up an entire event because the person asked for a story about something. Um, this doesn't belong in newsrooms yet. This technology, it's, it's just not there. Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.